In this video, we will show you how to use your new morph strap. The strap comes in a cardboard tube and requires a morph case suitable for your phone. In order to attach the strap to the case, align the housing of the strap at a 45 degree angle to the case. Insert the mount into the housing and twist 45 degrees. Once it's been locked in place, you'll notice a snap. The phone can be mounted in four different positions. If the phone is in any other orientation, it won't be secured, so make sure it's been properly attached before using the strap. The strap can be used as a sling, over the shoulder, or around your neck. And then you might want to adjust the length a little bit, so you can do that by pulling the ends of the strings here. In order to shape the strap, you pull out the D-ring, twist it until you feel some resistance, maybe half a turn or a turn. And then you can start to morph the strap into the shape you want. So I'm going to go with a tripod shape like this. And once I have the shape I want, I can turn the D-ring half a turn or so to really secure it in place. One or two turns is enough for most phones, but if you have a large phone or you have a more demanding shape, you might have to tighten it a bit more. The maximum number of turns for the D-ring is four revolutions. And once you reach the limit, you'll hear a click. But don't worry, it won't damage the strap. And to loosen the strap again, simply unturn the D-ring in the opposite direction. And you're back to having a loose, nice strap. The sliding steel ring is an attachment point for the morph trigger that can be purchased in our shop. Now you know everything there is to know about the morph strap. And we have a few new products coming out soon in the morph universe, so make sure to check our website for any cool new product launches.